So you saw in our first video several months ago, um, we had the tractor out here and we were tilling everything up. And now look at our garden. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Come, Come take a look. <laughs> Come on, Taylor. So don't mind the weeds. We haven't been out here in about a week and they've really, we've had a lot of rain and they've really, really came up like crazy. And we wish that some of our other plants would have made it, but we just got so busy with things and couldn't come out here. But right here, we'll show you, we have some okra plants. Oh, wow. And this, you know, as you can see, we had a whole row, but only one, two, three, four, five plants have made it. And actually there's more. We probably need to thin these out because they'll get, oh, that's a weed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> but this is probably enough okra. This is probably too much okra. Like we're gonna be picking okra every day. There's zucchini squash. Over here we have more squash, it's getting crazy huge um this is a bush bean as you can see we have beans coming already we actually need to pick some of these and come look at this our pole beans are just going absolutely crazy look at that oh something ate that look but these are perfect look at that look how big that one is mm -hmm. this is our second time picking we already had a huge sack of them i'll uh i'll edit in a picture of that and we've already eaten a bunch of them I mean, we just got tons of beans. Look at this, Taylor. Wow. That bush has a lot too. Yeah. So, oh my gosh. Look at all these beans. <laughs> I got them beans. So, I better stop picking. I'm gonna get carried away. Um, and we have our corn here too and as you can see this is gonna, this is our corn growing right there it's starting to silk and the whole goal was you know this was my first garden or excuse me our <laughs> garden everything's coming up good but not exactly how we planned but we're still like yielding tons of tons of beans now over here the first thing we planted was potatoes the deer have really gotten to our potatoes um, they're looking kind of depressed. Only one of our rows came up. We really couldn't stay on top of the, the weeds and the grass, plus the ground was super hard. So we planted carrots and another row of potatoes over here. And we just didn't, we just kind of let it go. We let it get overtaken. And, but we still have this one row. But as you can see, the tips are being eaten off and fresh deer tracks. It's been a Bambi buffet over here. We've been going buck wild on our potato plant. Over here, we have got some more corn planted and we have our tomatoes. Check this out. Tomato plants doing really good. Some of them are doing not so good. I think that one was definitely, oh, I just, I think that one was probably eaten by a critter, but this is what we're really proud of. We have pumpkin here, pumpkin there, pumpkin down there. And honestly, we probably planted them way too close to the watermelons <laughs> because our watermelons are going crazy. And check this out, <laughs> little baby watermelon. Look at that. Awesome. Cannot wait. 
And I mean, there's going to be way more. We're going to have like a huge patch out here. And then we're going to be planting them later, but this whole area over here, I think we're going to put some tobacco plants. We'll see about that. But as you can see, our garden straight popping off. Come on. Let's go look at the bush beans. Yeah. Mm. So those are going to taste different than the ones you have in your hand? You know, honestly, I don't really know. They look the same. They look about the same. They're fatter though. It's fat and short. They're chodes. <laughs> <laughs> so, look at this. Yeah, we need to start picking. Okay, see look, these have been eaten by deer. Oh see that? my, we gotta put some kind of... Look, look. <gasps> we gotta put some The deer fencing. have been decimating our bean population. Wow. Look at that. Yep. My gosh. It's open buffet over here. But they're not eating the beans. For now, yeah. They're eating just the, they're eating the, uh, just the leaves. We're gonna have to get out here this weekend. We're gonna have to, well, we need like to. really pick and then I'm gonna have to let out. I'm gonna have to put out some of that. Uh, look at that. Some fencing. No, just some sort of like, what do you call it? Repellent. Oh. I might even try to do that hair technique, you know, where you just put a bunch of human hair out. Really? Oh. Yeah, since I'm a barber, I got yeah. plenty of it. So, yeah, that's, they came through, ate it up. But I'm really excited about this corn, even though some of it's, needs to be. like I said this is our first go around we definitely have some lessons learned and um, we're gonna do a winter garden I think our winter garden will do really well but then next spring is when it's gonna be a game changer it's gonna be crazy you think it's popping off now next spring gonna be crazy. Look at the Bronco. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Real bad. Real bad. These beans. More beans, more beans. <laughs> <laughs> Are those all for you? Oh my God, look at that. Oh my goodness. Looks like a old lady's arthritis fingers. <laughs> Yeah, I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> They're like balls. He's so sick. <laughs> <laughs> He's so sick. All right. Look at that. We need a bag. Yeah, we do. We need to pick these. Okay, we're out here getting these beans. Yeah, see, these are not ready to be picked. Right. Like, don't pick those. Even if they're kind of flat like that, right? leave them alone. Okay. Get the ones that look like those arthritis fingers. <laughs> <laughs> these are probably okay. Eh, those are a little flat, but... I mean, we have so many... Still eat them. We have so many that... That corn right there is doing good. I know. Because you don't have as many bush beans. I know. Yeah. Okay, back to picking. Pick, pick. Got some sort of critter, ants or something. And I think, you know, it's okay to like snatch them, but I think they're really ready whenever they just kind of easily pluck off. You know, you don't have to like really yank them. But I think as long as they're not real flat and slender, you know, round shape to them, they're they're fine. Mm -hmm. I'm 
having to go behind Taylor because she's missing so many beans. <laughs> So as you see, this was like, what, like 10, five or 10 minutes of picking beans out of our little garden right there. And this is our second batch. I've already picked one batch that was roughly the same size, maybe a little bit smaller. I mean, we're talking like, I don't know, a couple pounds right there. And I mean, this is definitely enough to to do like, I guess depending on how many people, at least three or four different dinners, you know? Um, so anyway, our beans have been picked and now we're just waiting. We're just waiting on the other things to grow up. Hopefully uh, the next video will be us picking some squash. Corn. Hopefully digging up these Thank potatoes in the next couple weeks we're just gonna go ahead and dig these up and have some potatoes and hopefully the good lord blesses us with a pressure canner <laughs> and we'll be able <laughs> and we'll be able to preserve some of this stuff for a few months so well um, okay once again thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and like my videos